hello hello everyone welcome back again to my youtube channel if you are new to this channel please subscribe and if you're a returning subscriber thank you and god bless you how are you all doing today so right now on the internet space my thorough people we've had another alleged information from the palace of Ileife. so this time around it is coming from a beloved uh, friend mother sister everything of Olawi, naomi shilekola so my correct people at this point if everything that is happening in the palace is not giving you concern i don't know i don't know like seriously so we heard allegedly that reverend funke adejumo that her in fact this thing that is happening in the palace is giving her serious wahala serious trouble you know there is how you be friends with a family like this and if they are passing through hard time you find out that you if only that you are getting the heat yeah you are not the person uh undergoing the hard time but you'll be getting the heat because you will not be happy yeah even uh the bible says it that you should weep while others are why your friends or something are weeping and they rejoice with them when they are rejoicing it's not when you see your fellow person uh, rejoicing you'll be like oh wishing that the person is uh, weeping and when you see the person weeping you'll just be smiling or laughing at the person so my correct people we had allegedly that uh, funke adeju modo really reached out to uh, uh olori to be concerning everything that is going on in the palace of ileife so according to her alleged my correct people remember all these are alleged informations that we gather on the internet space i keep saying it i'm not living in the palace of ilefe so we heard allegedly that uh, reverend funke uh, reached out to toby and was like advising all of it to be that uh, she should say the truth and save herself and the entire ileife the embarrassment this embarrassment that she's just like just about trying to uh give to them that she should if there is anything she needed to expose that she should go ahead and do it after all to air is human and to forgive is divine so she was like reaching out to toby in case there is anything toby is hiding let her spill because since she gave birth a lot of people have just been coming in with so many secrets from in fact including her best friend her ex-boyfriend a lot a lot of people are just like coming into the palace with different different stories on a daily basis so i don't blame anybody that is just like asking her to say her truth if there is anything she knows and if there is anything she wanted to tell kbac so reverend funke had already reached out to all of it to be a lot of people we are like oh that's so thoughtful of her that it shows that she has the interest of the palace at heart a lot of people do already congratulate her for trying to uh ask to be questions to know if there is anything to be is hiding because at this point <laughs> if you are not confused i don't know what you are waiting for my confusion is even confused right now so my correct correct people uh she equally uh told all of naomi never to be distracted by the wind that is blowing that very soon that god is going to put the wind on a heart and she's going to enjoy the fruits of her labor i'm on another one i enter my ear queen naomi ah god though she's going to eat the fruits of her labor ah god i can't wait i can't wait because this woman she has sacrificed a whole lot for the palace of ileife during the time she was there as an olori omo kinomi sacrificed a whole lot the funny part was that kabiesi never uh appreciated her efforts then uh, because of the kayam matter that was working in his life through this or always then but thank goodness that now kbs realized well 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 and that is the reason why he is going after queen naomi to make sure that he brings queen naomi back to the palace of ileife so my correct correct people according to information reverend funke had already carried out shook for the matter yes in her words allegedly she wanted toby to come out and say the truth say it in the way it is if there is any truth to be said i'll be waiting to say i'll be waiting if there is any truth to tell the public let her come out and spill the truth so my correct correct people and they equally um give queen naomi hope the hope that part of giving queen naomi hope is sweet me for belly well 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 because um, at this point if you don't know that what is happening in the palace now is just the wind the a breeze is just blowing very soon it's going to stop you know they blow, blow rich forever 
yes breeze no they blow rich forever it will blow 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 and just calm down yeah so uh she was like telling queen naomi that she should calm down that the way we uh breeze take the carry palm front uh hair in go carry and go up carry and go down carry and go north carry and go south letter letter in go still drop them now like that nine debris take they carry both caviar sequin naomi and the olores that very soon the breeze is going to drop all of them and people that was able to um to face the breeze will stay quishes olobi naomi and kabiesi we got already destined to be together but those ones that the breeze blew away they will go away further away into thin air we are kabiesi is not going to see them so reverend funke advising olobito b phillips was like please do oh, let nothing happen to those kids don't wait till the day go go where they are going to welcome you in to share the uh, uh the um the secret because it's going to be here yeah, somehow somehow in the, inside the palace so my correct people what we understand uh, uh from her this thing um is she trying to advise all of it be and all of it naomi as well let all of it to be spew whatever thing she knows let her say to her to avoid story that touches the heart and let me naomi not be uh let her legs not be shaking let her legs be strong let it stand giddy bar for inside the palace 30 mega so my correct correct people at this point queen naomi needs those words of uh, encouragement and the reverend funke adejumo came at the right time time so congratulations to queen naomi omo the kind of friends that this woman keep like this uh, ah they are the type of people that they are always there for queen naomi they are always there for queen naomi she like all like, queen naomi know they lack in fact any word of encouragement from this all of risk they will and um, from this set of friends that she has they will always be there for her they will always console her when she's in uh, in, in agony or as in when she's facing sort of a uh, depression or so so my correct people and they will equally ginger her when she's loved and when she's feeling loved my correct correct people reverend funke adejumo what do you think about her action a lot of people they talk saying her over sabina in the worry her we think carry her con shook mouth for inside all of it to be matter but i guess those people are from haters yeah those uh, comments are from haters then other set of people we are like eh, that uh, she is a woman of god that she should tell us the paternity of a uh, uh, all to be twins I, I was like no be everybody no be you now now you they shout say you need dna how reverend funke will come tell you the dna of toby twins again even if to say god reveal and give them if she says it to the public they no go believe they no go understand uh, her then go they still demand for the dna so anybody that is just like telling her to uh, reveal the paternity of uh, toby's twins i guess as well the person is uh, equally coming from uh, the haters or something so she did write for what she uh, for uh, as an uh, advising them i don't know about you what do you think uh, of her actions if you feel she did right let me know under the comment section and if, if you think she did wrong let me as well know under the comment section i will see you soon in my next upload bye bye thank you and god bless you